In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your own landing page and email marketing funnel quickly, easily, and for free. This is by far the easiest and most user-friendly system I have found for setting up a landing page and email marketing funnel. And I want you to stay to the end of the video because I'm going to show you some other things that this system.io, that's what it's called, can do that I have personally used that have made me hundreds of thousands of dollars and continue to make me money every single day. So stay to the end of the video. Okay. So the first thing you have to do is obviously sign up for a system.io account. You can get a free account and they're pretty generous with a free account. You can get uh, 2000 contacts in it and unlimited emails. And this is really important because you want to be able to send to often to your list. So you can start off with this free account and then move up and even the higher packages are very competitive. I'll explain that later. So here's how you, um, you build a funnel really easily with system.io, a, a funnel, a lead page and an email follow-up system. We're going to do it right now quickly, easily, and for free. So I'm logged into the dashboard here. So the first thing I need to do is come here to where it says funnels, right? And create. And then I choose the name. I'm going to call it join newsletter. All right. That's my join newsletter funnel, because that's my goal. I want people to join my newsletter. So I'm going to click build an audience, right? And I'm, I'm going to pick a uh, US dollar. Then I'm going to click save. Now this is going to be the domain for the, for the funnel. And you can you customize this if you have your own domain name as well. I'm not going to get into that in this video, but you have that option. All right. So here we go. Click save. Now we have our funnel. So I'm going to click here, the name of our funnel, and we're going to create the page and I'm going to click squeeze page, right? Cause this is a landing page, a squeeze page. And you've got all these templates you can use all these templates. And actually there's like too much here for me. Um, I like it simple. So I'm going to come down here and even though I can start with these beautiful templates, see, I could pick this one. You just click and, and move it around here. I'll select this really quick so I could show you and you click edit and you could just change the words in here. Just click this here. I can, if I want to click this off, I click the little trash can here. I can bring in headlines, bullet list. You just drag it in like here, content box, videos. I can put a video here and on and on and on. You just drag and drop. It's very easy, but I'm going to keep it even simpler than that. I'm going to come down here and I'm going to pick a blank template, right? Change the template. Yes. I want to change a template. And so I'm going to come all the way down here. I'm going to keep it real simple. I'm just going to click a blank template. Here we go. Select the blank template. Now I'm going to edit this. I click the little ed edit button and I'm going to go to where it says blocks. I could just build my thing from scratch with all, all these different um, elements here, or I can just do it really easily. And they have opt-in forms right here. Look at this one. Bang. Beautiful opt-in form. I can put my video here. I can put my text here and I, I can move this around. I can modify it. I'm going to do that and you're going to see it in just a second. So here I go. I just quickly made the change. This change is a took me a couple minutes. I eliminated the phone field. Oh, I forgot to eliminate this. I'll show you how I, how you erase stuff. You just click the trash can. Bang. It's gone. And I've got the name and email. I, I customized this came down here. See, you can fill whatever you want here and it'll come in and say, be on the call to action button. I put my own video here <clears> that <throat> I just put the share URL here, right here. And I've got my bullet points and I'm good to go. Save the changes. I can preview it here though. I can see it here as well. And you know, we're not going to have this part up here, but this is a really nice, simple. I really like it. Straightforward, easy to read. Uh, opt-in page all above the fold. People don't have to scroll down. It's great. And this was totally point and click. You don't have to know any code or anything. We've got a really nice, uh, landing page here done. And back here to the dashboard, we're going to come here and now we need to have, um, we don't have any contacts yet, but we're going to set up a tag, right? 
tag and we're going to click create and we're going to call it join newsletter and the tags are for so you can track where your opt-ins are coming for uh coming from so with the free account uh you're 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 just not allowed to have one here or one here i believe i show you about the tags here in a second but that's the 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 purpose of the tag it's to tag the email so you know where it comes from it's coming from so you can target your mailing so you could might be able to be able to have lots of tags i believe you have to have the pro version of that this gets to the concept and then you can target your email campaigns towards the people who opted in from certain pages and it's much more effective that way that's a little bit advanced but anyways we have a tag now the next thing we need to do is a come to here and go to campaigns we need to set up a campaign so i'm going to call it join my newsletter join i'm just going to call it join newsletter there we go this is our campaign we're keeping this nice and simple so now i have a campaign now what we need here is we need some emails okay so we're going to come here and um you can use uh, your uh, a gmail account for this but you do have to verify it so I'm going to call this email number one. Of course, you would have a title, a headline for your email, like uh, download your software now. Here it is. All right, this is the first email they're going to get. So I'm just marking email one so we could know. Normally, we wouldn't put that. Anyways, here we go. We've got this. I just choose Classic Header. I like it better. I come here. Yeah, I, I haven't confirmed this, So, but that's no big deal. Okay. I just put in another Gmail account that was already confirmed. So this is email one. And for the the body, well, you can put whatever you want. Normally, you put a download link for the software, and we're good to go. You could do that on your own, whatever it is you're giving away. But you have the subject, and you have the body of the, the email you're sending out, and you click Save and Publish. Now, this is interesting. This is going to go out immediately, right? And zero days. So right away so we click activate there we go come up here click we could even test it when i can do that right now now we have our first email and we just go along creating more emails now i'm going to click put another one i'm going to put email number two and i'm going to come down here and i'll put the email Okay, save, there we go, and I'll just put this here, email number two, and you can put your whole body in there, save and publish. Now, we want this to go um, after this email. We This is going to be an email follow-up series. So we have our first email that's going out, where they're going to get the software, then we're going to have our follow-up emails promoting our products and services. So we want to make this a four-day delay. So four days afterwards, they're going to get this second email. And you could just keep going on and on, getting a second email, third email, email, fourth email, 10, 100 emails. You, you know, every four days, uh, 10 emails, that's for 40 days, they're going to be getting emails. They're going to get to know you. They're going to get to know about your products and services. It's a fantastic way to sell. I've done it over and over and over again. It works great. This is the way to go, folks, to create email funnels. It works. And I'm showing you how to do it. So you click Activate. And now we have our second email save. Here we go. Email one, email two. Of course, you would put proper titles in here and fill it out and make sure it's a really nice email. You take a little time. I'm just showing you the process here. Now, the next thing we do is come here to automations and we need a rule. And what we need is we're going to click create and it's a trigger. And what we do is whenever someone subscribes from the funnel. Okay we want them to subscribe to the campaign so we come here and we choose the funnel join my newsletter and then the funnel step it's going to be on the squeeze page and what do we want them to do we want them to subscribe to the campaign and what campaign well it's the one we just made join my newsletter and now when anybody uh, joins the from our squeeze page okay they are going to subscribe to the campaign we put up here which has 
all the follow-up emails. So they'll subscribe and then they're going to get follow-up emails over and over again. Because you wrote those emails before, remember email one, email two, they're going to subscribe to that. They're going to get whatever free thing that you offered in order to entice them to join the list. And then they're going to get follow up emails. This is so powerful. You got to do it. All right. So let's save this rule. Now I'm going to show you something else we can't actually do. I'm working off the free one right now, but we would also want to create a rule, another rule, but we can't do it really now. But um, it is. Um, what again, the same thing when it's subscribed, someone subscribed to join the newsletter from the squeeze page. What we want to do is add a tag. Okay. And the tag would be the tag that we have with the one tag. So it's not going to let us do it because we have the free uh, version, but if you get you know, the higher versions, you can have lots of tags. So when they join, we know that they join from that squeeze page and that will allow you to target your email marketing because you may want to have squeeze pages, different squeeze pages for different people, for different, for different processes. That's totally up to you. You have the flexibility, but now you know the concept of having a tag and how you would add it. Now I came here and I just gave this a name here so we can have a little identify it. Now here's the landing page good to go and we have uh, this crazy URL here now you can get your if you buy a domain name there's a way to make it so this is actually your domain name and they show you how to do it there I'm not going to go into that now but you could also use bit.ly or some short link shortener to uh, shorten this link tiny URL or bit.ly or some other services that will, which will shorten the URL or you can get your own domain name and they'll show you within the system how to use your own domain name slash whatever um, whatever landing page this is but this shows you the concept we've got a beautiful landing page simple and you can start promoting that and I just did this in a few minutes now there's one more thing you can do is of course would be a good idea to have a thank you page and it's a similar concept that's the page that people get to after they subscribe right they've got all these different templates here all right uh, hey, we could just select this one. I'm just selecting this randomly. Click here to edit it. You put your information and in here and you could eliminate a lot of this stuff if you don't want it. Right. Okay. And you could customize your own thank you page as well. So now I've showed you how to set up your own landing page with system dot system with me on the end dot IO. I'll put the link down below. You can get your free account. Uh, it's pretty much the easiest way I've seen to do this. Now, I know, I know how to do it the hard way, right? With code and, and all that. But I've been looking for ways I can get everyone to do this because it's so important. And this is a great system. Now, this system is even better. I told you if you stay at the end of the video, I'll show you a, a concept that I've been doing, which has really been working for me. See, you don't just have to use this for affiliate marketing. If you have your own products and services, I'm not going to go into how to do everything because everything would require a separate video, but you can sell your own products and services. They track everything and you can, you can set up your own courses and sell them and track and it integrates with PayPal and Stripe. You can go and have your own affiliate program. Now that's what I did. Now I use another system for my affiliate program, but they have it all built in here. Okay. They have it all built in. So you can come here and create your own affiliate program to sell your own products and services and set up commissions to, for affiliates to promote your products. And that has, I've done extremely well with that. I have three different affiliate programs I run and I did it old school, but this is much more efficient, much more efficient. It's all in one. They did a brilliant job with this so you could sell your own products also you can build your own blogs your own websites with this system it's a all-in-one system uh, you could do your funnel pages your email marketing blogs um, affiliate program sell product services you could also do funnels that are on your blog as opposed to just a, a, a separate uh, landing page wow there's a lot here I'm not going into everything I'm just giving you an overview but really uh, a great system. Now here are the different packages here. This is really great. Unlimited emails. You, that, that is a very good value. 
because you can go with um, Amazon SES. I do that. They charge you. It's a very good price, but they charge you per email. A lot of services charge you per email. They have limitations. Uh, they don't even on the free plan. Wow, which is great. Now, look at here, the unlimited plan. You think, oh, that's a lot of money. But I have a Weber and I have like 25,000 people on that. And I'm always taking emails off of that and putting it into my, I have my own separate system because I want to keep under 25,000 because they start charging me a lot more money. But I'm paying $149 a month. And I think it's even more expensive now for new people for a Weber. And, you know, this is actually a better deal, way better deal because if I, you've got that type of list, because I can do everything I can do with AWeber and way, way more, way, way more. So this is very, very competitive. Depends on the size of your list, but you could start here at this level, work your way up, work your way up, work your way up. And they have a lot of things you can do to build your business. This video is going on and on and I'm talking as fast as I can. So. I suggest get starting with this. I don't care what you're selling. If you're not getting e doing email marketing, you're losing money. If you don't have a funnel, you're losing money. It's one of the easiest and fastest systems I've seen with additional potential uh, on the other end. So go ahead and check this out. Get it going. Put the, um, click the link below. I'd like to ask you to also to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also, I've got a few more videos on email marketing. You're going to see them on up here. Please click as well. Thank you so much.